Hey, what's up, meatballs? Mr. Meat Hook here. Time today for episode number two of Mr. Meat Hook's shitty video reviews, where I review the best of the worst and the worst of the worst of micro budget and independent horror cinema. Today, we're going to be talking about the 1986. It's actually 2011. Chris Seaver film Death O'Lantern. It's a brisk 44 minute journey about a group of high school students, 30 year old high school students, but high school students that have to stop the ghost of Stingy Jack, who's this pumpkin guy in the front, from killing six high school students, or six of the students of Sleepy Hollow. New York has to stop him from killing them so that he can come back to life and live among the earthly plane again. This one was actually pretty enjoyable. I would say it's probably, in my opinion, Chris Seaver's best film. That's not saying a lot because I'm not typically a big fan of his work. Didn't really find a lot of humor that didn't work. I didn't notice any like ethnic or racial slurs, which kind of exist in his thing, in his little universe. He does a lot of homophobic slurs or not necessarily racial slurs, but really bad stereotypes. I've even seen characters in blackface, which is just so cringy. Anyways, um, yeah, I really, really enjoyed this one. The first death in the film was a death I'd never seen. And that was exciting. Um, you can pick this up at sovhorror.com. They have a bunch of titles there, a dozen or so. I have four. I'll be reviewing the four of them. I've already done the first one. The link for that's right up here. So you can check that one out. That was for the Dingleberries. Um, the acting in this is much better than it was in the Dingleberries. But this is played much more seriously where the Dingleberries is kind of a bad comedy. This is just like a cheesy horror film. It's played much more seriously. Not a lot of jokes in it, and the ones that are in it work better. Much less sophomoric than his typical stuff. Um, I suggest you check this one out, guys. I'm going to give this one three and a half out of five dookies. Anyways, guys, real short and sweet this time. But I want you to make sure that you click that like button, be cool, be spoopy, and support independent horror. Deuces.